Hi, my name is Dylan, and since I purchased an Apple Watch Series 3, my life has dramatically changed. I talked about that more in depth in my first ever YouTube video, so if you haven't seen it, make sure to check it out. With workout monitoring features, always on notifications, calls and messages directly from your wrist, an Apple Watch has quickly become one of the best products I own. In 2018, Apple redesigned their Apple Watch and add some essential mind-blowing features like ECG and fall detection. So what we can expect to see, or better, what we want to see in next generation of the best smartwatch in the industry. Enjoy! The Apple Watch Series 4 was a major breakthrough for the industry-leading wearable. With all new design, lighter, slimmer, larger screened, and faster than its predecessor. With that in mind, we do not expect any external changes to this year model. But that's not a bad thing. Apple Watch Series 4 is, in my opinion, a gorgeous device. Even Series 3 is quite good looking. The only change in terms of design we might see this year is a reintroduction of ceramic model. As Ming Shi one of the most trusted Apple analytics, has previously reported. Not changing the external design doesn't mean that the fifth generation of Apple Watch will be boring. Interior upgrades are always well Welcome. And this year, we expect an Apple Watch to be equipped with Apple S5 processor, which will of course be faster, alongside with 1 gig of RAM, which is more than enough for a smartwatch. In terms of battery life, don't expect any changes. It will still offer an 18-hour battery life just like the original model. And now to the fun part. The next generation of the best wearable in the industry is rumored to come with additional industry-breaking health features. ECG feature on Series 4 has originally been released just in the United States and has been expanded to a dozen of European countries this spring. This feature has proven to be spectacular and has already been saving lives on daily basics. And with Apple Watch Series 5, Apple is expected to bring that technology to another big step. They plan to make life easier for diabetics. They have a patent for non-invasive glucose monitoring. You are probably wondering how this will work because currently there is nothing alike on the market. As patent describes, Apple will be using absorption spectroscopy to quickly summon for you how this will work. Apple will apply light with known properties to a sample. When light passes through a sample, the substance, in that, in that case glucose, absorbs energy at certain wavelengths, causing the light properties to change upon the exit. Then comparing these properties to reference light will allow Apple to detect the concentration of glucose in your blood. Of course, there is much more to it, so if you are interested in more details, I uh, left a link in the description so you can check it out. But that's not all. Series 5 might add the ability to measure blood pressure with an Apple Watch. This is probably a much bigger feature since millions of people suffer from high blood pressure. And what is even more, Series 4 already has technology for this, but it is just not activated. Apple could measure blood pressure using pulse transit time. With pulse sensor on the wrist, Apple Watch would be able to measure the delay for the pressure wave to travel between two sides in an artery. With this information, an ECG that measures waves as they leave heart, Apple could get blood pressure numbers. Then there is another patent that shows a system that monitors chemicals in the air to smell which can track your body odor as well as 
air quality where you are exercising. From all of the previously mentioned patterns, this one is the most likely to happen. Another thing is slip tracking, which will definitely come. This is a feature which has been long requested. Maybe it will even be available with WatchOS 6. With Series 5, we will finally be able to track our sleep without needing to download a third-party app. As for price and release date, Apple Watch Series 5 will be released in September alongside 2019 iPhones, and the price will likely remain the same as Series 4 or a bit higher, so starting at around $399. This is all for today. I can't wait to see Apple Watch Series 5 on my wrist. If Apple managed to bring all of those health features to the next generation of Apple Watch, it would become the best health accessory you can buy by a long margin. If you liked that video, make sure to subscribe and don't forget to click that bell icon to get you notified whenever a new video is ready. Thank you all for watching, have a great day, bye!